light this shit up. Hello and welcome to today's full day of eating for building clean muscle mass everyone Try not to mind the mess behind me Today I'm going to get you through a full day of eating on a lean bulk for me Which means I'm consuming around 200 calories above my maintenance calories So that I mainly gain muscle mass and not fat So without further ado let's go to meal number one aka breakfast And I'm going to show you how to cook it in the most convenient and easiest way Let's go Maybe you guessed it already, but the breakfast will be oats and here I've got some chia seeds because they add so much volume and they are kinda delicious. Not very, but the volume is fine. Okay, I don't have an idea what I'm talking about right here. I guess I just confused or something like that. In fact, I love chia seeds and I forgot to tell you one important thing, I love high volume foods, it may not be very optimal for people that are hard gainers and they need to eat a lot of food because high volume foods will fill you up and you will not be able to eat too much. But I do love high volume foods and I eat them very very often. Just wanted to point that out, let's get back to our clip. And to cook that whole thing. I'll need some hot water which I already heated up here so I'm going to pour it in here no measurements only the oats are already measured they are around 95 grams yes and I will pour some water in here with the chia seeds as well to soak them up so after around 10 minutes this whole thing will be as twice as big and it will be ready to cook even though some people without waiting just cook the oats but I like to soak them up before I cook them in the microwave and if you don't like the microwave you will believe that it can give you cancer or things like that you can just use the pan or something like that but I don't because Ain't nobody got time for that. after 10 minutes I will see you again just gonna stir that up a little bit looks ready to me so now I'm going to put the oats in the microwave for around five minutes of course depending on your microwave's power mine is just perfect on five minutes and if you're wondering why I put the oats in such a bowl it's because I'm going to put it in the microwave and there it is really hot so you need some kind of bowl that is durable enough to take that heat and not just They are ready. Now this is where the magic happens. To make our breakfast we will need cinnamon, some salt, preferably some Himalayan sea salt because it's much better for you, one banana, some cacao powder or cocoa powder and my favorite peanut butter, preferably natural because it doesn't have any added sugars. Now let's see the end product. Okay, now that is the end product. that this meal right here hasn't got much protein but before I was having three eggs but this meal is very huge and has a big volume by itself and those three eggs were just too much for me and I felt bloated and it was horrible so I decided to 
eat only protein and fats in the morning without that huge thing but then I don't have any energy so I decided to leave the eggs aside and eat them later throughout the day and first thing in the morning well no it's not the first thing in the morning but first meal is this one right here it gives me energy it makes me feel good and again it's delicious and easy to make so what I mean don't worry about the protein I will hit it later throughout the day and breakfast is done as I told you it was super delicious without kidding this is my favorite breakfast for real now I'm preparing for the gym and let me show you what I'm going to eat right after my workout so what I will need for my post-workout meal is rice cakes some protein powder preferably isolate because it's a faster digesting protein and it enters your bloodstream very very fast a shaker to mix the protein and something to put your rice cakes and protein in and now I crush the rice cakes like and there it is the crushed rice cakes now I'm putting one scoop of that protein in the shaker and then I'm ready to go in the gym I just shake the protein and then I pour it all over my rice cakes then I mix it with a spoon and eat shout out to Nicholas Young for that idea I saw it in his Instagram and it is amazing okay guys I'm going to the gym today is push day I am going to record that workout but I'm not going to break it down at all I'm just going to make a super cool montage and let's start with it right now Just got 
back from the gym. I really hope you enjoyed that montage. Special thanks to my videographer whose Instagram I'm gonna put right here. Yes, you can give him a follow if you would like. He posts pictures every day, they are very impressive. By the way, right after the workout, as I said, I ate the rice cakes and the protein and it is amazing. You should try it, it's just super delicious. Now I'm kinda wet, I'm not sure if you can see it, but it rains outside. You can't see it from here because I don't know why, but you can't see it from here, neither can I. But I'm super wet and now I'm going to show you how to clean up in two steps. Step one, get a camera and step two, learn how to edit. But now guys, about one hour after the rice cakes and the protein, I'm already hungry, which means that it's time for meal number three, aka the most basic meal, yet the most, well not the most, but very delicious one. And this is rice and chicken. And this is meal number three. As I said, chicken and rice. And this on the side is called lutinitsa. It's a Bulgarian traditional sauce. I'm not sure how it's made, but it's super delicious. And this is my next meal. Time for meal number four. Man, what is wrong with my hair? Better. Ah, uh, yes, meal number four. I'm not sure what to eat for meal number four, but I'll think of something. Okay, I think I got it. It will be more of a snacks, but a very calorie dense one. Okay, for this snacks, we will need some yogurt. This is this looks strange, but it is homemade plums jam. It is without any sugar. Instead of that, we put stevia. It tastes amazing. And of course, some peanut butter, because I love it. Is that all you will ask? <laughs> nope. Yeah, that is right, X. Why? Well, I don't know, but some things in life don't need a reason to be made. Did I just give a life lesson by cracking eggs? Wow, I'm good. Some coconut oil, it's a good fat, it prevents eggs from sticking and it gives that pleasant aroma. That's all because it is not. Now some rice cakes as well. Well, you f***ed up my beautiful vlog. Now if you think that this is all, it is not. I will put some rice cakes as well. And now this is the next meal. Again, don't mind the omelette. The pan decided to become sticky right when I'm doing a full day of eating. Ok, 
Okay, so it's night time. I hope you really see me because the lighting is not so good. But I'm hungry and it's time for dinner, so let's get cooking. Okay, for dinner I have three main things. The first thing is salad, which is made from tomatoes and cucumber. It is topped with some parsley and some extra virgin olive oil. The second thing is mackerel on the grill and it is topped with some black pepper, sea salt and some lemon juice. And tonight's main star are the roasted potatoes which as you saw I made by putting some paprika, some black pepper, some Himalayan sea salt, some rosemary and again some extra virgin olive oil then I mix them and I put them on some parchment paper and then right into the oven on 190 degrees for around 30 to 40 minutes and this guys is dinner ok everyone this is dinner and the macros for the whole full day of eating are right on my wardrobe yeah pretty solid numbers and I think this is it for today if you enjoyed the video please smash the like button if you have any questions leave them in the comments below and if you want more content from me just subscribe and turn the notifications bell so you can see when I am posting a video okay thank you for watching again and I'll see you in the next one bye bye